Okay, well, welcome to the channel. Yeah, anyway, noticed uh, we had about 71 subscribers and recently we lost one. <laughs> Down with the ship, you go, you scallywag. Well, anyway, I don't care, you know, but I do appreciate the 70 people that are subscribed to this channel. And, you know, you, you, obviously I've got so many things going on with this from fixing cars to making tomatillos for tamales to trying to do Amazon and eBay. And maybe it's just too much information for you. So that person who left, bye. Anyway, um, that's not the point of this video. The point of the video today is, oh, hey, you're going to shoot your eye out. Take a part of ha. So we got that for the little ones for Christmas. Um, so hopefully that will work. Hey, you know what? Another thing, too, I wanted to show you. These little things are handy dandy. Uh, the magnesium fire starters. I highly recommend picking some of these up. I picked up a couple of them over at the Harbor Freight. Um, for the emergency evacuation um, kits that I'm putting together for the fam. Um, because we do live in an earthquake zone. And maybe, just maybe, <laughs> this will disappear if it happens. But anyway, um, it's Black Friday. I didn't go shopping. I'm going to go tomorrow. I'm going to go to the gun store, pick up some ammo. And, um, you know, we're going to take care of some things. I did pick up a couple things from the Goodwill. Uh, I got these extra large mechanic gloves. $4.99 I paid, and uh, I pick up a, picked up a license plate for the Cadillac. You know, I paid $2.99 for something that they wanted $8 for. Anyway, it's not a big deal. I got some other stuff I got on the table right now. The lighting in here sucks. The reason I'm doing this video today is because I called, uh, I got an email uh, on an order from Amazon that I have done this several times now and I've caught them except for the one. Once the package leaves and goes um, for the um, USPS, it's called Mailstream, I guess. Uh, that's the term they use. But I had a package come back. It was a priority regional A box that was coming back because I didn't have the right label on it. I had a parcel select label on a priority box not going to work. Somebody's going to catch it. And they did. It was a 50 cent difference. And I think I've mentioned this in some videos down below in one of them. And uh, it came back. This was back in September. So here is two months later. And I'm now addressing this. I got the email from Amazon. They said, well, the USPS rejected it. Sorry, because it was in Mailstream, meaning it had already taken off into the race to get to the to the customer <clears throat> and then it came back somebody caught it and sent it back and then i peeled off the label put on the correct one which was a ten dollar um charge versus the 950 and i sent it off and it went on its way and it made it in time um however trying to get the refund back on the 950 for the parcel select label not gonna happen. So that package cost me nineteen dollars and fifty cents. I lost money on that one, and it was a fifteen dollar order, and it went to the East Coast, I think. Uh, no, it went to Washington, Lo Lopez Island, actually, is where it went. Um, so back to my old neck of the woods. The um, the idea of this is to let you know, pay attention. I am notorious for not paying attention when I'm doing this because it's so fast paced and I click that first box in the seller hub when I do the shipping and I try to get the glare off of my glasses and it is some kind of like automation thing that I do I just click it take it for granted that it's a priority because I normally use priority shipping uh, great for insurance purposes up to $50 at the start and then you can buy additional it's faster um, and the price difference between that and parcel I mean check it out you'll be surprised I can get it there two to three days faster for maybe a dollar more at most so it is what it is uh, and that's the point of the video. Pay attention, peeps, when you do your shipping. So I have to get ready and take care of some things. Um, got my confirmation order on that one. Spoke to a really nice lady up in New Jersey. 
I was giving her a hard time. I was like, man, I can't believe I lost 950. That's one burrito I can't eat. And she's like, well, I bet you we got better pizza. And I was like, well, I bet you do, but I still got better burritos. So anyway, that was really cool to have that conversation with her outside of the fact that I was sulking in the fact that I just lost an additional $9.50 on a transaction that I wasn't paying attention. But lesson learned, lesson learned. So thanks for watching. Like, subscribe, and I'll see you guys on the next video. And have a good day.